hi guys welcome back to the channel my name is arab and you're watching a trap creators in this video i have just got you covered the review for the rise droid 3.5 os on my redmi note 10 many of my users subscribers were asking me about the review of this room so i have done with the review of this room if you can see this this is currently running on the latest version of 3.5 pixel version and it is a rise droid 12l and it is now officially supported device if you can see this there is a easter egg of android 12l and everything is got covered and it is having the latest 5th july security update and the belt number is rise droid 12.1 and the kernel here is is used is net error so you can definitely use this room there is no issues with this room so let me help you out to see the performance of this result that i ran all the types of geekbench and 2 is not working i don't know why but let me help you out i got 545 of single core without any performance mode clearly i am mentioning without any performance mode next it is the 1530 of multi core score and apart from that this is the performance mode enabled scores and you can see this 543 is single core score and 1523 is a multi score score and it is a 84% to its max performance this first time geekbench sorry not cpu throttle result and this is not got covered in any performance mode this is got covered in a performance mode which gives me 93 percent to its max performance all the cpu throttling used in 20 threads so this is a 22 973 is a storage speed test and it is a better storage speed test if you can see this and this is the 100 thread that i have settled in the settings many of my viewers have told me that i set the threads to 100 so this is the 73 percent to max performance is normal 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 mode but yeah it depends on this and this is the 79 percent which when i set this into 100 threads with performance mode so yeah it is little bit good and everything doesn't depends on the scores that we are getting from these apps safety net if you ask me it passes by default no need to flash any of the zip and yes guys if you like my videos please like the video and if you found our content helpful then please subscribe to the channel because many of our viewers doesn't subscribe to the channel it makes a lot hard to make a lot of content for yourselves and this is the drm info and i got covered it is having the latest l1 security level if you can see this yeah you can see this and Apart from that, Ant2 is not working. I already told you DRM info. I have already got you covered. And this is a root checker status. And this is not a pre-rooted ROM, so you can easily run any banking apps with no any hustles. And uh, apart from that, I have already got you covered. And this is not for the customization settings, no, internet and network settings. Everything working. As you can see, this I'm only using my Wi-Fi. There is no issues with that. The UI scrolling of this ROM is too good. You do get a modified Android 12 L quick settings panel and from here this doesn't come with any blur options or whatsoever and here you can see this you can edit titles there is many more titles available you can so edit also wallpaper and stylings no customization given in wallpaper stylings and in the customization part there is a bunch of customizations that I can't tell you in this full video but you can do check out this and you would be happy to see this and just I have changed the quick settings UI and everything I'm not going to cover about the settings setting out customizations and apart from that you do getting a another launcher which is being ported from CR droid but is a modded launcher so you can see this there is many more options available I do like this all I themed icons and you can see this all been converted into themed icons so i love this part of this room and if you can see this wallpaper and styling home settings uh, you can revamp any type of grid style you can change like this and i don't like this but i do like this this is the best and background op opacity you can manage use transfer this is a setting that you do consider while install after installing this room if you found our content helpful then please like the video and share with your friends that who wants the custom rooms in your in their device so thanks for watching my videos keep subscribing and if any issues comment down in the section